This is a featureless rifle that includes our CRG 15 grip, our AMBI safety selector, our extended magazine release, and our barrel thread protector. Starting from this end, the stock is fixed in one position. You can't move it. And that was accomplished with a thick paper clip and you can see that in another video on our YouTube channel. Okay, so our grip allows you to get a good hold on the rifle. It's uh, comfortable and very controllable, unlike uh, fin grips. You can wrap your thumb around it and get a full purchase on your rifle there. So what our grip does is it keeps the web of your hand above the top of the exposed portion of the trigger. You can see a legal analysis on our website from our attorneys about that. Our safety works very well with our grip because you can't really reach the safety on the other side of the rifle pretty much with every featureless grip. So we designed our safety to be uh, to have the levers mountable on either side. It's also a 90 degree throw or a 60 degree throw. I have mine mounted in a 60 degree throw and I also prefer my lever in the down position for safe. You can feel it in the way of your finger there and you just move that up with your knuckle to fire or down. So it's very easy and intuitive to control with your finger um, instead of using your thumb. And that's similar to how a CZ Scorpion rifle works. Our extended magazine release allows you to reach the magazine release without having to reposition your hand. With the mil spec button, you have to kind of move your hand over. And that's because our grip does move your hand a little further back here compared to where a normal pistol grip would be, where you could really easily reach the button. Back here, you do have a little bit of a stretch to reach that. So the, this works very well with our grip. These three products work great together. Lastly, we have our barrel thread protector. It looks nice and it's got a little bit of a taper on the end there and it could be mounted in either direction uh, to match up with the profile of your barrel. So if you have a bull barrel, you can mount it this way or if you got a little bit uh, smaller diameter barrel, you can mount it the other way and that will just kind of match up with the profile there. So overall, this is very controllable and a very usable rifle and you can see how everything works very well together.